Narito na ang latest update na Super Typhoon Betty or international name na Typhoon Mawar. Ayon po ito sa bulletin na inilabas ng pag-asa as of 5 p.m. Sabado, May 27, 2023. Ayon po sa pag-asa ay bahagyang humina ang bagyong Betty at ito ay kumikilos pa westward. Hazards affecting land areas with heavy rainfall outlook para po sa mga lugar ng Batanes, Baboyan Islands and the northern portion of mainland Cagayan, Apayao, Ilocos Norte and Ilocos Sur. Meron ding 50 to 100 millimeters of rain dyan sa loob nyon and the rest of Cordillera Administrative Region. Heavy rainfall naman sa Tuesday afternoon to Wednesday afternoon with uh, 200 millimeters of rain dyan sa Batanes, 100 to 200 millimeters dyan sa Babuyan Islands, Ilocos Norte, Ilocos Sur at La Union. Sa mga lugar po na hindi apektado na super typhoon, ito naman ang monsoon rains ang uh, magbibigay ng malakas na ulan, lalo na dyan sa Mimaropa, Visayas at Mindanao, bukas, linggo. Sa Monday at Tuesday, monsoon rains are likely over the western sections of Mimaropa and western Visayas and possible over the rest of Mimaropa and western Visayas. Under these conditions, ayon sa pag-asa, flooding and rain-induced landslides are likely to take place, especially sa areas that are highly or very susceptible to this hazard as identified in hazard maps and in localities that experience considerable amounts of rainfall for the past several days. Strong winds naman sa mga lugar na nakalagay sa tropical cyclone wind signal number one. Ito po ay ang mga lugar sa Batanes, Cagayan, including Baboyan Islands, Isabela, Apayao, Ilocos Norte, the northern and central portions of Abra, Diyan naman sa Kalinga, Eastern and Central Portions of Mountain Province, Eastern and Central Portions of Ifugao, Northern and Central Portions of Aurora, at dyan naman sa Quirino at sa Northeastern Portion ng Nueva Vizcaya. Super Typhoon Betty is forecast to track westward in the next 12 hours before turning west-northwestwards. Ayon sa pag-asa si Betty ay mananatiling super typhoon over the weekend although it will likely maintain its strength for the next 36 to 48 hours. Short-term intensification is, is not ruled out especially in the next 12 to 24 hours. However, ayon sa pag-asa, ang tropical cyclone na ito ay hihina considerably sa lunes at martes during its slowdown period over the waters east of Batanes due to potential unfavorable conditions. Ang center po ng Super Typhoon Betty ay estimated based on all available data at 1,035 kilometers east of central Luzon. Ito ay moving westward at 25 kilometers per hour. Maximum sustained winds ay 185 kilometers per hour. Maximum sustained winds ay 185 km per hour near the center at may gustiness na 230 km per hour. Manatili pong mag-ingat. Abangan po ang susunod na bulletin na pag-asa ngayong alas 11 ng gabi.